Hey guys, what's going on? It's uh, CBC, and I know it's been a couple of days since my last uh, video, but um, uh, I've been doing a lot of summer school work. I've been getting a lot of assignments, you know, case studies and uh, midterms and all that stuff. So got that through and played a couple more matches, just trying to keep my streak going. And there's not really much of a threat. I keep running through a lot of the common common styles of players at the. You know, turtles jumping in the back, kind of spamming a lot of things. Uh, I don't see anything other than Dante, Wolverine. Um, I'm starting to see Morgans and Trish a lot now. And Sentinel. I mean, I don't know what it is with people. And Magneto. They don't, like, they're so hungry to win that they just pick characters that they see win in tournaments. And then they stop. And I can't forget Akuma too, but every Akuma I see is trash. Not not all of them, but I mean like you could just tell they're waiting to get level three and spam, and that's why nowadays I just tag in uh, Akuma before their their second character dies, just so I could uh, not have to worry about that risk. Um, so distracted, I can't even remember what color Doom I am right now. I think I'm the black one. Yeah, I'm the black one. <laughs> um, because of the head, the mask changes, they don't change colors like the characters. So I hope they fix that because, you know, sometimes you don't even know. Um, so this guy's using an Arthur, uh, Morgan, and a Doctor Doom. Um, I really feel that Capcom needs to start patching their game just like NetherRealms is doing for Mortal Kombat. Uh, I don't understand, you know. There's, there's a lot of things in this game that have been immediately needed to be patched other than just infinites and broken glitches that we as a community are finding for them. You know, it's... Uh, it's really pissing off the community, and Arthur is one of those characters that needs to get uh, an upgrade some way or another. Not health, not projectile, but something to do with his movement or an uh, or what, some of his moves, because it, it's an obvious uh, con that he has as a character. And I think I just X Factor here to kill, and there you go. But yeah, back to what I was saying. Um, Magneto's meter gain that he gets off his hits has to be altered. Characters who have potential especially specifically to fly and just do heavy dash, heavy dash, heavy dash, literally pressing two buttons and gaining a meter and a half to two meters and do, being able to use a level three is bullshit. Nobody, nobody can bitch about that. Even if you use Magneto, you know it's, you know it's nonsense. It's, it's, it's too much. And DHC glitch, uh, enough people are talking about that, and that's on its countdown. So whoever's using that, you better, you know, take advantage of it now because something that cheap is going to be going away. It's not fair for certain characters. Let me give you an example for Deadpool. His best meter building combo, okay, does not allow him to set up for his uh, his slice and dice hyper. Now. Magneto or any fly character in general can do that at the same time while building much more meter and doing their uh, more friendly DHC hyper. Now, that is immediately unfair. Now, in order to balance that, you can counter that argument by saying, oh, their moves are different, they have different potential, oh, this guy has projectile, blah, blah, blah. No. It, those arguments end up losing value because get to the core of the game, okay? Um... For Doctor Doom, some characters who even fly, uh, like Doctor Doom, unless you're in the, unless you get your, unless you get your opponent in the corner, your fly combos do not work because the only move you can do is your medium slaps. But at that time, you know it, it's ineffective because you, you do your medium hyper. All his hypers, other than the, the plasma rain, are very weak. So, and I just forgot that I did my infinite. 